Hi Kyle Wilson students and families. This is a quick video to show you how to set up your Zoom account for the first time with Prince William County and how to log into Canvas. So you can see that I have split my screen. So on the left, I have a Zoom guide for Kyle Wilson students. And on the right, I have my search uh, bar open, ready to follow these steps. So the first thing that we want you to do is to set up your Zoom account. And the way you do that is by going to zoom.pwcs.edu. I'm gonna go ahead and type that here. And it's best to use Google Chrome when accessing Canvas. So I'm gonna press enter. And now you'll get to the Prince William County Strong Zoom page. If this is your first time setting up your account, you want to click Sign In to configure your account. So you'll click Sign In, and you will get to your Office 365 uh, login. So you're going to want to put in your login information. This is where you will put your username followed by the at sign pwcs-edu.org. I'm gonna go ahead and put an example in. Okay, there's a student username. Click next. This is where you're gonna put your password and this is the password that you may have just recently reset using the uh, password reset toolbox on our website or um, it may be a password that you may have remembered from last year. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that in. Okay, and click sign in. Now you are in Prince William County's Zoom and your account is all set up with your Office 365 and you do not have to do anything further with setting up your Zoom account. You can simply close it and now you're ready to join Canvas. We highly suggest that you do this before the virtual open house next Thursday when you get to log in with your child's account and see your teacher's Canvas page for the first time. Or if you can't make that, make sure you set up your Zoom before the first class meeting on September 8th. Now I'm gonna show you how to log in to Canvas. So we're asking our Kyle Wilson students to log into Canvas by going to our school's website. You can do that by typing wilsones.pwcs edu. You can also search for Wilson ES PWCS and the first school that will pop up will Kyle R. Wilson Elementary in Woodbridge. And press enter. This takes us to our school's website. You can see our school news here. If you scroll down, you can even see that there's a password reset button that you can click. So if you ever forget your password, as long as you have your student number, your date of birth, in your Office 365 username, you can reset your password. So we're going to follow these directions here where it says go to student login at the top right of the page, right here on the top right. Now it's going to automatically log me in because my computer remembers me and I've been on Canvas several times. But when you do the student login for the first time, you'll see the Office 365 where you'll have to put in that information again your username and password. I'm going to click student login. I'm actually going to sign out of this one so you can see what that looks like. When you log in, you'll log in with your Microsoft Office 365 username and password. And then you'll get to your Canvas dashboard. My dashboard looks different because I have different courses that I'm attached to. But for you, you should see your teacher's course and that will become available before open house next Thursday. Here's a sample course just to give you an idea of what that may look like. So here I have three courses. I'm gonna go to my home page. 
For you, it should say your home room. When you click that, oh, ignore this. I'm gonna just go ahead and log in as myself again. I had logged out before. This is similar to the way you would have logged in with your Office 365 username. and your password. And then it will log you into your Canvas page. Okay, I'm gonna move my screen so you can see what that looks like a little bit. There we go. So now you can see an example of a home page. You're gonna look for your Zoom Meetings button your Zoom Meetings button, and it will be on your teacher's home page. You will see Zoom Meetings with a little icon to Zoom. You click that. Once you click it, you're just going to wait for your teacher to open her meeting or his or her meeting and let you in. And that's it. You'll be ready for your first meeting.